Hi everyone, today we have this new exercise in AutoCAD isometric drawing series. Um, this drawing has uh, something special which is the angle here. So that means the length of uh, this segment from here to here is not, is not given. So everything else is given but this, uh, this, uh, this length. So how to find it? Well, in AutoCAD isometric, we cannot draw the angles as in uh, regular rectangular 2D drawings. For example, if we started drawing this angle, let's say we draw a line in this direction and uh, we tap the tab button, then uh, write uh, 90 plus uh, 45, that is uh, 1. 35 and if you notice we this angle is not uh, 45 you can make sure from here angle this segment and this segment so the angle is 15 so how to find how to draw the angle in AutoCAD isometric well there are many ways, but my own way is to draw this uh, this angle in regular to the rectangular system. So we go to object snap settings and from snap and grid rectangular snap. And we start drawing. This uh, line segment has a length of 88 and uh, the height is 56. And we draw another line here. We tap the tab button and write 135. Okay. Now draw a line in this direction and lengthen this one. Sorry, again. Now trim. Okay. Now we have to know the length of this segment. So Dist for distance from this point to this point, so it's 32. Okay, in x direction is uh, 32. Delete everything and start uh, and go uh, go again to object snap settings, and from here isometric snap. Now start drawing. We have 88 and. In this direction, we have 56, 56, and in this direction, we said 32, and then close this angle. Okay, now we have drawn this, uh, this segment. Okay, now copy this line from here up to here, and draw another line from here up to here. Now copy. Sorry, delete this one. Draw another line from here up to here. Now copy. Press F5. And this distance is 50. Okay. just to draw like a cube okay now delete this these ones okay now we have drawn the cube the outer cube okay now from here we have a height of 18 so we draw a line at the height of 18 and we go inside and here we have uh, before that we draw a line from here up to here okay now we draw a line from here uh, and we have a height of 18 then we go to this direction a distance of 28 
and we go up okay now trim and also this one from here we have a distance of 12 we go up and trim sorry trim now link these two points and delete this one now trim this one it's not needed anymore and also this one okay now link the point A to point B L from here up to here okay Now we draw a line from here, press F5, line, okay, and copy this line from here, a distance of 12. Okay, now we draw another line from this intersection point up to here and also from this intersection point to here now trim okay Now from this direction, we have a length of 38. After that, we go to this direction. Now copy this segment from here, a distance of 12. Okay, but before that, lengthen this one up to here. Sorry, delete this one. Copy. Okay. Now we have a vertical line from here uh, extending a distance of 56. We copy this line from this point up to this point. Now we trim. Okay and also this now link them this one up to here and this one up to here okay now no need uh, or just trim this one and also but before trimming this segment we draw the bottom or the base of this uh, shape press F5 okay now uh, trim and link this point up to this point okay now trim Okay. We have a vertical line, uh, but before that we have a horizontal line extending a distance of 50. Now vertical line. okay and the last line is this one f5 
frame. Again, we have a vertical line here. And a horizontal one. Press F5. Trim. And now draw a horizontal line here. Okay. Trim again. And draw a vertical line here. Now delete the reference lines. But before that, trim The last line is here. Now trim and also trim these two lines. And this is the final shape. If you have any question, just write it in the description below. Please do not forget to subscribe, like, and share. Bye.